the epigastrium, the umbilical and the hypogastrium. On the right and the left side, we will find three regions on each side again. They are called as on the right side, the right hypochondrium, the right lumbar and the right iliac regions. On the left, they are called as left hypochondrium, left lumbar and the left iliac. These are the nine quadrants of the anterior abdominal wall. The kidney can also be surface marked on the posterior abdominal wall. Let's have a look at it. On the posterior abdominal wall, search for the spine of T11 and the spine of L3. Let us draw a horizontal line at these places. Next, we will draw two vertical lines. The first vertical line should be 2.5 centimeters away from the midline. And the next vertical line is 9.5 centimeters away from the midline. By joining all these four points, we make a Maury's parallelogram. That's all in the class today. I hope you had a good time learning anatomy today. See you in the next class. Thank you.